good morning guys welcome to today's video girls and i are on barn duty and we're late i know i know what's new right what's new we're always late in the morning because it's hard to get up it's actually easy to get up it's just hard to get ready and come down and i'm not ready yet i still need to brush my hair but we are here yes penny pickle you guys hear her she's like feed me now girls are coming hard morning huh There are so many things that Sam doesn't do when he's in the barn, when he does chores, like clean the arena. So I always end up having to clean it the first day back. Clean the, the little paddock here, cut the grass in front of the barn, all the stuff that he doesn't do is the stuff that I do at the first day of the week that he's back at work, which is today, Wednesday. All right, it is, uh oh, it is leaking. It is scorching out this morning. So we're gonna try something fun. Sophie's gonna try something fun. All right. If she likes it, you're gonna get her her own pool. We don't know. Actually, why didn't we take them to the quarry the other day? We were gonna. The quarry was open. No, it was open the other night. Certain hours. We just have to figure out the hours. All right, here we go. I don't think she likes it. She's got her leash around her nose. Oh, a nice girl. It's water. Show Molly. Oh, good girl. She's like, help. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Yay, good job. Don't come near me. Don't go. Oh, she's wet. Ah. Oh, and I can sit down. Oh, yeah, it was a bad idea. Bad idea, Sophie. All right, listen, you guys. There's some kind of infestation in here. Do you guys hear it? Listen. It sounds disgusting. I think it's an infestation of crickets. Can you guys hear them? Listen. They stopped making noise. It is the end of a garden, you guys. It's almost finished. I took out all the beans and all the peas. It'd be looking really rough. Needs more water than I can provide at the moment. It's supposed to rain today. It was supposed to rain yesterday and it only rained a little. One thing is for sure, every single morning when I come out, I still have a lot of things to pick. I have a lot of tomatoes ripe every day. I'm gonna give this thing some water and try and pick them all now. Even if I move stuff, branches that are falling over, I find more. Like it's a never end. It'll take me an hour to pick all the tomatoes today. Also, I don't think my melons are gonna get much bigger, which is okay, because who likes big melons anyway? Uh, I'm just waiting for them to ripen. I think they ripen based on like the patterning on them. I should be able to tell, but I'm not sure exactly. They turn more of like a brown color. This one's kind of getting brown. Check on Chino. Sophie didn't come because she's not feeling good. Go ahead, Gabby. Uh, and I was thinking like if Chino's right outside the gate, then that's a bad sign. Like he's not even eating the hay. He's just eating little bits of grass. It makes me nervous. Like, ugh. Anyways, I'm dropping Gabby off because I'm going to get coffee for her. And so if he's still not feeling well, she feels fine. And she just doesn't have like a lot as much air as she, like anytime Sophie gets sick, it doesn't matter what she has, it always hits her lungs and she always doesn't have very much air. So she's fine, moving normal, talking normal, everything's normal, but she can't do like excessive energy. It's not, well, she has asthma. I guess that's what it is. She has asthma and whenever she gets sick, it brings out her asthma. And so she doesn't want to ride because it hurts. It's hard for her to breathe too much. It's hard for her to get enough air. So I'm gonna go get coffee and we're gonna see. I see Finn moving. I, see Ch I saw Chino running, so we'll see. Okay, honestly though, Gabby always wants these potato wedges and you get like five, fr five fries in there. Five? Oh, I'm already full. More than five. So Fiona wants you five. to lunge him. Look at how cute he is. 
with his head turned to the side like that. Like he literally likes to favor. He mad that you turned off the fan. I know. Ew, there's a bug on me. Ah, it's in my shoe. Now. <laughs> Good job. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Goodbye, bug. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what is happening? Okay, so what, what do you think about the pads? I don't know. They're leather, and I don't know. I don't know either. How was he walking? Oh, he ran away from me. Oh. Yeah, he's feeling great. Okay, all right, well. Sophie, I was going to come give her a lesson, but I told her we would lunch him first, or what do you want to do first? You want to lunch? Sure. All right, so we're gonna lunge him. Let me finish this. Look, he wants a fry. Oh, but horses can't eat fries. They can't have potatoes. No, he's such a handsome boy. Oh, he's mad though. Look at him. He's like, oh, I refuse this. Mm. How does he look? I think he looks good. But I don't know. Fiona's coming. My best friend didn't care about the rules good on the weekends I'll be I don't think he knows what to do with those pads he wore boots boots are different yeah I think it's I think it's because like with leather pads it has that insert stuff that fill stuff so it's like it's I don't know we're gonna see we're gonna see what happens when Fiona gets here Let's see if if he's okay with them. So our farrier said like he has other things he can try if this doesn't work for him. And I don't know that he was having pain. He was just like, what the heck is wrong with me? Okay, Fiona's here now. So I was just telling Fiona that like he definitely notices that they're there. He doesn't understand what's happening. He had boots on though. He's grabbing boots. Yeah, so. But on the bright side, we stepped on a big rock and we didn't trip. Oh, so you stepped on a rock? Good. Yeah, he's feeling good. So. No, he is. He's feeling good. He's like, I see the baby. Fools drift in the deep space. So brave and so stupid. Just like the movies. How it's gonna stay in the fight with you. Just thinking we would do this. Can you grab a whip? Yeah. Please, please. Do we need the whip? Yeah, there we might not be able to do that one. Since we couldn't do it. Each and every high, every night with you. You and me so clueless We were just broken, shattered Singing along to nothing matters Stray around like nighttime rumors We were in I mean, he, he looks fresh as heck. See, she's not even pulling his head and he's... I know, and he's not, it's just him not choosing to not eat the hay. Like Finn's out there, no problem. Hey, no problem. Change rain. Two point. All right, so basically he still seems funny, but we don't know if he's like, if he's expecting it to hurt. We're just waiting to see, we're just trying for a few minutes to see if he comes out of it. If he doesn't come out of it, we're fine with not going to, to Trillium. Like, he has to come first. That's right. But are the pads gonna fix him? The like, pads should protect him. Yeah, I know, but if he already has a bruise, it will prevent him from um, causing any more pressure on the bruise. So it will help the bruise to heal faster because there's no... Except for that padding that's in there. That's like constant pressure, isn't it? Is it? So it's gel and the leather moves. Gabby's dying. She thought, she thought she had a two point for the whole eight you minutes. You also change direction too. Trot him over those poles in the center.
we're going home. So Gabby did not have a lesson. She just rode him for a few minutes, see if he like was just, you know how sometimes they are like anticipating a sore? And it's mild. It's not like he's like dead lame or anything. It's just the same as it was the last time we tried him a couple of days ago. So he is improving, but just slowly. And the pads did not make him worse. But so, anything that made him better, because now he doesn't go lame turning on gravel. Yeah. So, like... my raincoat. That's my raincoat. This is mine. Oh, I brought your raincoat. Mine's so Columbia. Much. Oh, shoot. Good thing I didn't write. Mine's men's size medium. Uh, men's yours. size medium. And it's also made in Vietnam, so... That's not mine, then. Mine is made in Canada. Anyway, we're going home, and we're going to see what happens. Like, Gabby's already qualified for champs, so basically as long as nobody like bumps her past seventh then she's good to go to champs and she wants to go to champs so i guess we're gonna see what happens like sh we're gonna see you guys and if it's not meant to happen this year then it's not meant to happen this year and we just have to figure something else out but don't you worry we could have another show this weekend a different show and then he'll be doing it all so uh, fiona met with like some new clients a little girl and her family two little girls and and the grandparents and they came to the barn and, and met Fiona and I took them for a walk to see some of the horses and Finn was right there yeah Finn was so weird like he came walking up to them and they were really excited to he see him kids. yeah he actually did so he didn't care about the 10 year old that much he literally went right up to the little tiny girl and stuck his face right in her the face the tiny girl was too scared to pet you know yeah, she was too scared to pet Finn too, and Finn really loved her. Look at how nice and, and mowed the lawn is though. Like, isn't it gorgeous? Go for that. No. Yeah, we'll see you little weeds. Dad should come in and cut it all yeah, down. Yeah, he will come in cut. and cut it all down. Chop it off. I love watching the dogs hop through the grass. Where did it begin? Where did it end? Hanging on those strings. Penny now and she follows me out. She's like, don't leave me here. I have a treat for her but I'm interested in which so pure so in the course that we took um the lady talked about like all the different personalities of horses and Penny's a curious horse so I'm interested to see what she does when she notices the pool what she does notice the pool I'm being loved on <laughs> breathed on blown on <laughs> she's getting brave she sees it See if she goes in. Oh, the mini is. What is she doing? Go in there. Do I think she'll go in? Nope. Oh. She wants love, this little pony. She loves to be groomed and brushed and played with and pet and touched. Don't you? Yeah, you do. Oh, feels so good. Yeah, feels so good. <laughs> so this is what I never get to show you guys. Because it's different as soon as I turn on the camera. But this little pony actually loves me and wants to be with me all the time. Like, when I'm sitting here, she'll come over and I'll groom her, which I already did. There's a bunch of hair down there. And I'll groom her and she literally grooms me back like sh she gets really close to me and she like she loves it it's the craziest thing because i didn't really have a bond with this girl but she does love me you do love me huh sweet princess yeah she 
she's like, are they treats? But as long as I sit here, she doesn't ever leave me. She always stays with me until Penny comes over and Penny does come over and get furious. She's been over already a couple of times to push her off and then she runs away. She doesn't like her hair on the side. I like it on the side so it doesn't bother her. She hates it. As soon as I do that, she flings it back into the middle. And now Gracie's turn, yeah. I love you too, Miss Gracie girl. Yes, I do. The two, the two best friends over there having their nap. This is how they have their nap. This is how they sleep. It's nap time. Dog knows we're taking her someplace. I have no idea how she knows. How do you know? Like she understands English. Uh oh, watch out. All right. I think a part of the reason that this summer has been so weird for us is that one, Kaylee's working and she's always gone now. Two, uh -huh. all the places that we go swimming around us are pretty much closed up. But we're gonna take our dog swimming today. It's gonna be so fun. Like I miss taking them swimming. Why are there things on my seat? I put towels on your seat. No, on your seat. No, no, no. We gotta fight for this spot now. <laughs> Daisy's like, what is happening? It, uh, so you guys remember because she's deaf, she throws up in the car all the time. So put one of those towels on you just in case. I'm not holding her. Her <laughs> deadly paws. Yeah. First call, we're getting ice cream at Kaylee's work. Hi, Kaylee, we want ice cream. <laughs> I love your store, it's so cute. Thank you. She loves Kaylee. She loves Hi. Kaylee. She's like, I'm out of the house. Oh, Gabby has allergies. <laughs> I was watching, not happy. I got pistachio, pistachio walnut? What is it, pistachio almond? What'd you get? My dog almost made me drop my ice cream and I'm holding her back leg on me. What'd you get? And we're fine. Um, ice cream. So we're at the little, it's like a little boat launch that we're gonna take them in. It looks like a little seaweedy along the, along the shore. So I don't know how well that will work, but. Um, well, before we go and take our doggy swimming, Daisy's doing great in the car. Right. Time, time for dogs to swim. I don't know if we can go in there. There's like a little bit of. Uh, my dog's not gonna go in. Hey. Oh no! Get it! Get it! It's sinking. It's floating. Oh, other dogs are here. Let your dog go in it. That's stuff. Molly. Look, she's looking. Oh, she sees it. I saw it. I saw it. She's looking. Go back and get it. Good girl. Good job. Get it. Good job. Yeah. What a good girl.
All right, we're not gonna stay too long here because of the bad condition of the water, but Gabby's dog pooped. And we don't have a bag with us, so Gabby has to use this cup. Oh, I'm not touching that. <laughs> Wait, you gotta figure out a way. You want me to look in the car for a bag? Oh. We're trying to find stuff Gabby can use to pick up the dog poop, Gabby. but she's not impressed. <laughs> the bag is not bendable, and it's wet, so it's already falling apart. Here, use this. You can just, you all you have to do is like scoop, or like go like this, and then squish it in. <laughs> <laughs> what are you gonna use? Work. Like that. All right, so like oh my we're gonna work. we're gonna be here a while till Gabby it. figures out how I'm to pick up. <laughs> well, you need to clean your poop. So. <laughs> oh my god! We'll see you guys there tomorrow. You Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way.